My name's Chris Jacobs and this video will provide you with some crucial information regarding your new gear pump. The humble pump is the heart of any system and it's critically important that you do everything you can to protect it against contamination. Here are the steps that we recommend to follow when replacing your old pump. It may be that you will need to do additional steps but this will depend on your system and the application. Before you start, you must ensure that the reservoir has been fully drained and that all contamination has been removed. If you have sufficiently maintained your current system's filtration, the oil should be cleaner than using new oil. It's therefore recommended to continue using this oil. However, if you have any doubt, then you should replace the fluid. Hydraulic supermarkets sell all grades of top quality hydraulic oil, so contact the sales team for prices. If you're using a variable displacement pump, you must ensure it's primed before you start. If your system has a suction line ball valve fitted, that needs to be opened before you start. It's vital that you are not on full working pressure when starting your new pump. You should reduce the relief valve setting, allow the pump to run for a period of time, and then gradually increase the working pressure until the desired pressure setting is achieved. After assembly, you should check all hydraulic lines for leaks. It's the responsibility of the user to ensure that they are in full compliance with the statutory health and safety regulations. This includes risk assembly when routine services and maintenance work are undertaken. Hydraulic equipment supermarkets have been supplying leading brand hydraulic components for over 50 years. We have over 30,000 items in stock with full technical support available. Please see contact details on screen for more information.